Pokemon Coliseum is by far the best 3D Pokemon title. Big league tournaments, unique Pokemon combined with a darker tone and setting make for an unforgettable and distinctive experience unlike any other Pokemon game. Oh, come on, man. You've got to be kidding me. The best 3D Pokemon title? Take those nostalgia goggles off, Jack. Any of the modern 3D games are better than that rushed job. XD Gale of Darkness is a far better game. The characters are better. And the game Really, Sleepy Joe? The characters? You're telling me you like Michael and Jovi over Wes and Rui? Hey, now, Jack. It was my time to talk. Gale of Darkness isn't as grindy. There isn't a garbage difficulty curve, and there's more Pokemon to catch. Plus, Shadow Lugia. Everyone remembers Shadow Lugia. Not the freaking ho oh you get after Mount Battle. It's the challenge that makes Colosseum so special, Joe, but you wouldn't recognize that because everything should just be easier, shouldn't it? Are you for real? I shouldn't be able to make it all the way to the final boss only to be out-leveled and outgunned. And don't get me started on accidentally fainting shadows in Colosseum. I had to do so many resets in my recent playthrough to catch Suicune. Oh, what's that, Joe? Sounds like a skill issue to me. Will you shut up, man? It is not a skill issue. Cope and seethe every time you have to go to the Relic Forest to purify Pokemon, while I can just stick them in the purification chamber. Well, you know what, Joe? Maybe I like going to the Relic Forest instead of going to the lab. What if I caught a virus from the lab? You can't be serious. The only virus in Pokemon is Pokerus, and it only spreads to Pokemon and has beneficial side effects. And since when are you worried about catching a virus? I'm not. Who cares? The locations are better in Colosseum anyway. Everybody loves the under, Pyrite Town, Agate Village, and Gate and Port is inferior to Phoenix City. Outside of the under, all of those locations are in XD2. And since, when do you like criminals? The under is the seedy underbelly of Ore and where Corn Pop lurks in the shadows. Hell, Corn Pop is probably an admin for Cypher. There he goes again about Corn Pop being in his video games. Some in the under, I assume, are good people. The Cypher Cartel is a vicious organization that must be stopped from preying on the innocence of the under and pyrite town. Oh, please, Donald, it's not a cartel. It's just called Cypher. You just wish Realgum Tower was a Trump Tower and hotel. Realgum Tower would be a lot more beautiful if it had big, beautiful Trump letters on it. It would be as beautiful as Cypher Admin Gorrigan. So you admit the characters are worse in XD? No, that's not what I'm saying at all. For example, Myra B in XD is a perfect package of style and... An amazing battle theme. Oh, wow, the one piece of music that anyone knows from XD. Colosseum soundtrack is one of the best in the entire Pokemon franchise, and it was only written in two weeks. You know what I'll give you? That Donald XD has a great soundtrack, but Colosseum's OST has such a strong track list unified by repeated melodies and motifs that Ore wouldn't be the same without its inclusion. Joe, I'm glad we can both agree on the splendor of composer Tsukasa Tawada's OST. However, we must both agree on one other thing. Pokemon Company, all we want you to do is MOGA. Make Ore great again. Yeah, Pokemon Company International, build Ore back better. Let genius sonority cook Mr. Masuda. Stop wasting their talents on Cafe Mix unless you add ice cream. There he goes again. Next, he's going to ask for Pokemon chocolate chocolate chip version. You just want to go back to Ore because it's the only way you'll ever win in the state of Arizona again.